He's a mentor for so many people. He was the one that made the first camera that went to the moon. And he's a scientist that's been working at NASA and all around. I guess it's a cop-out answer. My parents. My parents. My parents have been my mentors in my life. Especially my dad. My mom, especially. He taught me that perfection is lots of little things done well. I have wonderful women in my life, but the best mentor has been my mother. My mom. Well, my mom has been my biggest mentor in my life. She passed away six years ago, but it's all the things that she used to tell me are still with me. And she told me to be strong and to be independent. She has taught me just the drive to keep going, even if things get hard, even if things are difficult, just to like never stop. She's been a mentor uh, leading me and guiding me, uh, first with the foundations of the Bible, uh, has been the biggest thing my mom has given to me and a gift she's given to me. And I think she's really kind of instilled that sense of having a hard work ethic and dedication to see your dreams come true and be successful. But more than that, she's shown me um, unconditional love uh, throughout my life and has been able to walk with me in every journey and on this journey of life together. Who has been a mentor in your life and what have they taught you? Mr. George Carruthers, he's a mentor for so many people. He was the one that made the first camera that went to the moon and he's a scientist that's been working at NASA and all around Washington, D.C. for over 40 years. We're here now for his uh, funeral. He passed away December 26. Hey everyone, I gotta be honest, I hadn't heard of Dr. George Carruthers before. His family told me to look him up, so I did, and I wanna share something with you. This is from the National Society of Black Physicists, and it says, he will be remembered as an amazing scientist, engineer, professor, and mentor. Dr. Carruthers is considered the inventor of the ultraviolet camera or spectrograph. He also invented the camera that took the first images of space. His work has been instrumental in the fields of astrophysics. And it goes on to say that he received the National Medal of Technology and Innovation from President Obama. It is Black History Month. There's a link in the description below so you can learn about an influential black scientist here in America. If you've made it this far, don't forget to like this video and let's get back to it. He taught me that the most important thing is to care for others and to be real. He was one that gave so much out and never asked for anything in return. He was a great guy and he will truly be missed by the family. And I am truly honored to be able to say I'm his first cousin. I think that when I think about mentors, I think about a boss I had when I was working in a college. Mentor in my life was my last boss. And I think what she taught me was how you can be powerful and authoritative without being unkind, or you can be, have power and authority while still being kind and supportive to your employees. She taught me how to be a better human and how to uh, be empathetic and to listen and to treat people kindly. Well, my mentor has always been God. Like he, he has taught me, being brung up in church has taught me to hold on to your faith, regardless of what's going on, to always pray, seek higher, the higher power, and to always have faith. I mean, to always pull together family-wise, friend-wise, it doesn't matter, just, you know, that's my thing. God has taught me that family, you know, us being out here together, no matter what our race is, we need to be as one. We are as one. This is this is our world and we need to take it together. That's about all I can say. I mean, it's unity. It speaks a lot and we, we lack that here now, but I hope that we gain it in the future. So I guess a mentor in my life is actually one of my former professors for grad school. I actually have two neighbors that were uh, older, older gentlemen with families. Uh, from the Caribbean. One was an attorney. He uh, 
did criminal defense, and the other one worked in law enforcement. And she taught me a lot about like the world of maternal and child health and just um, learning a lot about how important it is to like fight the disparity, especially in the United States, where the disparities are really great um, between just different populations of people and things like that. But uh, the one uh, who was an attorney, I actually interned for him for some time when I was in high school. And he completely changed I would say the, the course of my life at that time. She just taught me a lot about, you know, working hard and um, doing research and the importance of science and research. And uh, and I was able to uh, sit in with him on some of his cases. It just showed me how much knowing politics and knowing the law and how it can work for or against you uh, impacts everyday life. Um, yeah, she's been a great mentor in my life and just forging a path in that career field. It was a great mentor towards me. Um, and he taught me a lot in my formative years. So who has been a mentor in your life and what have they taught you? My parents have been my mentors in my life. My, my dad, just because he's taught me uh, to, to work hard and to, to follow your dreams. To just grow up and be a great person, to make sure that I do things right and in order because what you give in life, you could be returned the same way. So it may not be reflected upon my life, but it may be reflected upon my child and my grandchildren. So my parents have taught me to basically live life to the fullest and make sure I do right by others. And that's it. Nice. Thank you. Right. you.